Tottenham's hopes of keeping Antonio Conte beyond the end of the current season appear to have received a welcome boost. After PSG boss Mauricio Pochettino insisted that he will 100% be staying at the club this summer, Conte has been linked with a move to the French capital in recent weeks. After doubts were raised over Pochettino's immediate future in the wake of their disappointing Champions League exit in early March, Conte was recently said to be keen on ditching Tottenham after just five months in charge, and replacing Pochettino in the dugout at the Parc des Princes if the latter is relieved of his duties ahead of next season. However, the current PSG boss has since moved to play down concerns over his role at the club by confirming that both he and Kylian Mbappé are set to remain in France for the foreseeable future. 100% in both cases we will be staying, Pochettino told reporters. There haven't been any concrete talks beyond what is normal in terms of our plans with what we have been doing so far. We have a natural relationship, we communicate regarding different topics. Of course, they change depending on the circumstances at the time but the relationship and the communication are good. We keep working hard, not just bearing in mind the present, but also with the responsibility in this job which is to think about the future, so that is what we are doing. That is how I feel today. That is what I can say to you today. I can't say anything else, that is how I feel right now. This is football, and we never know what might happen, but I have to answer the question based on how I feel today, and this is what I have done. Meanwhile, it seems likely that Conti will stay in his post at Tottenham. If Pochettino is not sacked by PSG between now and the start of next season, the Italian boss is contracted until the summer of 2023, and has managed to bring Spurs back into the hunt for a top-four finish in the Premier League since replacing Nuno Espirito Santo in November. Conti is expected to be heavily backed in the summer transfer window, as he looks to reshape his squad in order to prepare for the possibility of Champions League football or, at the very least, a return to the Europa League next season. He successfully landed Juventus duo Rodrigo Bentancur and Dejan Kulusevski in January, and will be hoping to follow up with some more high-quality additions in advance of his first full season in charge.